Mike Mullen from MikeMullen.net. Saturday night, Chicagoland Speedway. What a heck of a finish. Two hours of boredom, 60 miles of what the heck is going on. They were even beating up on poor old Jimmy Johnson. Kurt Busch took him right out of the race. Down the stretch, thought Jimmy had it won. Mark Martin wound up winning the race, dominated it. Had to put on a furious finish to hold off Jeff Gordon and Jimmy Johnson and I don't know what Denny Hamlin and Brian Vickers were doing, but they were making it worthwhile. I'll tell you, there weren't a lot of fans here. Maybe 40,000, maybe 45,000, 75,000 State Arena. But the ones that were here, they saw a good finish. Now the first two hours, I think we're seeing a pattern. But the car tomorrow on these mile and a half tracks, the first two hours, hey, go to sleep, drink a beer, eat some pizza, and then come back for the last half hour. That's when things really heat up. Guys were crashing right and left. It looked like a Martinsville race when you went through the garage afterwards. They were all over the place. Even Kyle Busch was uh, having a rough night. Kyle Busch, he was never in the game. He was lapsed down so quickly, it was unreal. And then he was crying on the radio all night. Car wouldn't handle, no horsepower in the engine. The engine finally blew up, he hit the wall. Wouldn't say anything after the race, walked away. Oh well, that's the way things go. Mark Martin wins, championship contender. Looks pretty good to me. Mike Mullen from MikeMullen.net.